we talked about lying especially in younger children in one of our videos let's talk about lying in teenagers and older children if you are prying too much into their lives they want to keep something to themselves they want to keep their lives to themselves they may end up lying so it is very very important that you pry less and give them that space to grow to become that adult that they are on the path to number 2 you know sometimes when a child commits something wrong and the parent says tell me and i won't do anything to you and the child tells them about the parent still punishes them this forces children to lie so it is very important to have a transparent relationship with your child that however bad come and tell me about it don't lie about it if you come and tell me about it your punishment will be less so maybe you can put it like that to them but if i find out that you were lying about it then i am going to forfeit something that you like or some time that you like etc so it's very very important that children are aware that lying is something that is not acceptable for both my parents and lying is something that will not let me go scot free it's I, it's better if i tell the truth because if your child lies to you and gets away with it it becomes a habit now your child is going to lie in every relationship that your child is going to be in whether as their child grows up and works in a company or lies to their partner and so on so it's very important to nip lying in the bud but yes very very important that your child shouldn't be used as a tool to lie to somebody else for example you take your child to eat ice cream and your partner doesn't like your child to be eating ice cream and you tell your child don't tell papa that we went to eat ice cream today now then you are giving a foundation that lying is good so it's very very important that lying is a phase that teenagers and young adults go through how we handle them will help us weed out this evil called lying